Hi everyone, my name is Sharon. So God is saying that if only they knew who you are, if only they knew who they were speaking to, there's certain things that they would not have said to you. There's certain things that they would have asked from you, but they don't know who you are. They are underestimating you. They are despising you. The same thing also happened to David. His older brother was despising him. He said to him in the book of 1 Samuel chapter 17, verse 28, that when Eliab, David's oldest brother, had him speaking with the men, he bent with anger at him and asked, why have you come down here? And with whom did you leave those few sheep in the wilderness? I know how conceited you are and how wicked your heart is. You came down only to watch the battle. Yet David did not only want to watch the battle. David wanted to fight in the battle. David wanted them to watch him fighting. Yet the older brother was thinking that David is there to only watch. So God is also saying that people are underestimating your capabilities they are thinking that you are only there to observe them you are only there to check their faults but they don't know that you are there to do the actual fight you are the chosen one for that position they don't know that that is why also when you read from the book of john chapter 4 verse 9 when god when jesus was speaking to the samaritan woman and asking for water and then the samaritan woman said that i am a samaritan and you are a Jew how can you ask me for a drink and then verse 10 it says Jesus answered her if you knew the gift of God and who it is that asks you for a drink you would have asked him and he would have given you living water yeah so you could see Jesus telling her that if you knew the gift that I have it also just shows that David's brother Eliab did not even know the kind of gift that his brother was possessing the kind of gift that David had the person who sent David he did not know he did not know that is why he was responding that particular way so God is also saying that your life is going to shock many many are going to think that you came to observe but they will be observing you because God is going to use you mightily God has put his powers inside of you has put his gift inside of you and he wants you to use it in the mighty name of Jesus amen